I managed to get the maps, the thing that we came to this godforsaken place for. The thing that may give us a new goal and a hope for the future. After the dark, claustrophobic bunker, the vastness of desert seems to embody freedom. I must deliver the maps to the Aurora, but I don't think anyone will mind if I take a few detours along the way. This desert seems to hold many secrets worth uncovering. Dehydration already. It's only getting worse. We also need fuel. The local bandits have it all. I had already contacted their so called Baron, but his terms proved to be unacceptable. He'll hold us where they get the water, but naturally, the well is guarded. The mirror recounted to the place and says we could infiltrate it stealthily. So, Martin, when you're ready, go rendezvous with the mirror. Your goal is to bring water to the Aurora. Failure is not an option. Good luck, Artyom. I... We are all counting on you. Crest, how's the weather? The storm seems to be over. I'll go back to the post. Perfect. What have you got, idiot? What can I say? We clearly didn't come here in vain.
Got it all figured out? Sure seems so. The radiation levels are plotted in color. Ha! They even have the radiation level dynamics here. When is it from? Hmm. Yeah, a bit old. Well, let's hope the situation didn't deteriorate since then. Which maps have we got? Central Asia, Western Siberia, the Urals, the European part of the country. Aha, I see. No Far East. Weird. I see two options here. Either the Far East was out of the satellite center area, or... or somebody snatched all the maps of the East before us. If that is the case, they still left plenty for us. Where should we look, Colonel Sir? I'd forget about the large cities. They were priority targets. Still, going for the deepest end of nowhere isn't too attractive either. But this place seems clean. Ah, no wonder. It's just a step. What if we go north? North, uh, no good. See? There's a lot of fallout here. Should have gone milder after 20 years, but I still wouldn't advise a prolonged stay there. Yeah, this is going to take a while. Check this railroad out. It's most probably the one we're going to use to get out of here. Yes, it does look like the only way out for us now. And that is why we should study it in as much detail as we can. What if we take this fork? A lake? A river? Radiation's not too high either. Artyom, while you were out, I finished making one more thing for the Tihar. The workbench is at your service.
Are you ready? How are the guys doing with no water? While you were away, I scouted it out a bit. As you might suspect, we're approaching the spring through the back door. Kuehl says lots of people used to live in these caves. Uh, there was basically a real town. But then the geysers opened up and they all had to flee. Let's go! <gasps> well, the bridges are burnt now. Let's climb a bit higher to get a better look around. The cave isn't going anywhere. That's some noise! What's that? Huh? Ah, Shaitan! Stupid bats! Yeah, this place is totaled. When setting out, I kind of had hopes of finding something about my people, if not my relatives. But now I find out. And it hurts. Steady, steady. Aha! Uh -huh. Right at the entrance. Get ready, Artyom. Charge the torch, check the filter, and other gear. I have this feeling, a vaguely unnerving one. <laughs> well, to hell with the feelings. Here, let me give you a boost. Artyom, masks on! <sighs> so, the war really did put people back into the Stone Age. Cave, paintings and all. Oh, they toughed it out here for some time. I wish we'd gotten here earlier. Ah, okay then. We're in luck though, there's still some space left. Oh. 
How many of them are there? We cross the bridge and head right. Looks like we're almost out. Follow me! The passage to the spring! Let's go! Another cave-in! My filter's almost done for. Look, light! Here. Well, the air seems all right. Masks off. Necessary bloodshed. The slaves are innocent. Look, water. See that car? I'll move there and hide behind it. The gate is controlled from that tower. When you open it, I'll rush the car through and you leap atop the tank. Good luck, and try not to kill anyone but the oilmen, all right? Are they going to relieve us or not? 